Ever since 1980, the Rendlesham Forest UFO incident has been seen as Britain's Roswell incident. But what if we were to tell you that a recently obtained lost interview that was never broadcast has now put this incident right at the very top of unsolved UFOlogy files and we're going to tell you why. Wait till you hear this. The Sun Online recently obtained information about this incident which claims that the two airmen who investigated strange activity in the forest on December 1980 were in fact abducted by an advanced civilization for hours before being returned with no recollection at all that they had this lapse in time. Now in secret video footage, the deputy commander of the base at the time, Charles Halt, can be heard stating that Burroughs may have been abducted and that the men were unaccounted for for hours. It is believed it is the first time Halt has ever made the bombshell claims and they did not even appear on his official memo of the incident, which was sent to the Military of Defense. Jim Penniston and John Burroughs were the men who famously claimed that they got so close to an unidentified object, apparently parked in Rendlesham Forest, that they could see Egyptian hieroglyphs on the outer shell of this UFO before it took off at a frightening pace. To the two men, this was minutes, but in reality, they were gone for hours and there was even a search party out looking for these guys as the worst was feared. There was no radio communication from the pair. Two nights later, the UFO returned and Halt led a team of military experts into the woods in a bid to debunk the claims. However, the military team were shocked when a beam of light from the UFO hit the ground just a few feet away. Halt, who made an 18 minute audio recording of the incident, went on to write a memo detailing what happened, which he sent to the MOD, but defense chiefs said the incident was of no defense significance. Former UFO investigator at the MOD, Nick Pope, said the revelation was hugely significant. This is a bombshell statement coming from someone who was deputy base commander of one of the most sensitive military bases in the NATO alliance at the height of the Cold War. It's one thing to see a UFO, as Halt and many of the men under his command did, but it's quite another to suggest one of your men might have been abducted by aliens. A few weeks ago, it would have sounded crazy for a senior American military officer to believe such things. But following the revelations about the Pentagon's secret UFO project, maybe it's not so strange after all. What do you guys make of these bombshell claims? Do you think disclosure is knocking on the door of reality? Comments below and thank you for watching.